right, for number 1, we have the circle, and for A, we need to state the x-intercepts of the circle. Okay, so what are the x-intercepts? Well, this is 2, 4, 6, and 8. So this right here is 7. So the x-intercepts are, this is, zero, this is 7, 0. And we have another one right here. It crosses the x-axis right here as well, and it's minus 7. So minus 7. And zero. Okay, for B we have to state the y intercepts. So the y intercepts occurs when it's two, four, six, eight, so it's zero, seven and minus seven. So zero minus seven. And then for C we have to state the radius. Well the radius is equal to well here, look, one, two, four, six, seven. Here's seven. Here's 7, here's 7, here's 7. So that's the radius of the circle. The radius of the circle is 7. And then for D, now we have to state, well, write the equation of the circle. Well, we know that the equation of any circle is x squared plus y squared equals r squared, r being the radius. But what's the radius for the circle? It's 7. So we have x squared plus y squared equals to 7 squared. And then x squared plus y squared equals to 7 squared, which equals to 49. So therefore, the equation of this circle right here is x squared plus y squared equals 49.